The, the course is really technical. It's a lot. It's the most buoys I've ever ridden so far. Um, it was really technical at first. I missed a few buoys, but after a few runs at it, and we're going to go practice again today. It's uh, it's going to be pretty. It's going to be pretty fun. Uh, boat was running great. Uh, both the uh, KMG Blaster and the uh, Commander Industries Superjet are running fine. Both boats feel really good, and I'm just gonna look forward to making it happen. Gomez and I were switching it up a little bit on those turns, it was fun, a lot of fun. Top Tropic, it was a lot, you have to really think about which lane you were going to take. I knew Mark was right behind me, I saw Tanner going a little long, he looked a little wobbly from being tired, so I went behind the guy in front of me that I was last time. And Ooh. it worked out to be here. Now I was burning for the first, but the, our boats were, I think, equal. Both built by Webster, so both, both boats were just at the same level and we got behind the lap people and that's what slowed him down and I caught up to him but we're still we're just I think we're like five yards ahead of each other behind each other. Not really, I mean we're both pushing the same amount. I mean I was I was just burning the entire last few laps and the back was on fire. I've got those short bars for freestyle so it's it's tough to stay that low for the entire race. We're right there. It's equal equal match the whole time. That was good moto. <laughs> All right, here we are, end of the day, Minden, California. Me and Mark Gomez coming up from the south up here, we're at 500 miles. But hey, Mark, great to see you out here in this kind of event. Good to see you too, Mike. It's a great event. I had a lot of fun here. Um, drove down here, or drove up here with uh, Tanner Thomas from Alaska. We had a great time. We didn't really know what to expect. Um, I know it's a great event, but uh, had two great killer motos, um, uh, four killer motos. Uh, a lot of great classes, a lot of good competition. Uh, it was cheap to get here and uh, cheap to race, and I don't know what else you could ask for. It was a good time. Well, our biggest thing is we like to promote the kind of the low end of the motorsports. I hate to call it that, but right now, jet ski, it's the lowest form of motorsports. I'm talking not low like oh. us. I'm talking money-wise where, dude, 500 bucks, you could be out there looking like a pretty cool dog out there riding oh, yeah, jet skis. You can. <laughs> yeah, you can. No, I mean, it's... Um, like I said, it's, it's affordable, totally affordable to come here to this event. Um, I got a lot out of for I got a lot, a lot of bang for my buck, I should say. Um, I was again, I wasn't too sure what to expect, but it was a good time. A lot of good people, good atmosphere. Everyone wants to race and have a good time. Uh, Jim puts on an, a, a killer event. Uh, Safety is a big standard, and he doesn't budge from that. So everything's pretty legit you, for an underground race. It's uh, I'll be coming back for more. That's for sure. Well, I'll tell you this. What do you think about Jim's tracks? Because that's what it attracts me every time because he makes them competitive. They're not totally wide open. Yeah. Where a guy like me, I show up with a limited racing against dogs on the modified, but I can still kind of use my talent to have fun with it and still be competitive. That's why I come to Jim's races. This track, um, again, I'm, I only have about a year's experience racing. And from the courses that I've done, even APBA and... Um, uh, I haven't done IJSBA yet, but I mean, the, the course is not, it's, it's just a all around course. You've got tight technical splits, uh, you've got a wide open, um, you've got a wide open uh, sprint down the back, and you know, you've, 
it, you've got a lot of opportunity to make up time and um, you know pass somebody or it, it's it's good though it's not a lot of I mean you can get into some rub racing but um, they don't really look they don't look at that here or they don't look for that because they want you to make that those uh, passes in the splits and it's possible with these tracks because it's so technical and every route is different and it's with your speed and your timing I had a blast I had a great time both blaster and uh, my super jet I uh, had a great time what that's what it kind of comes down to though because for me they're not factory sponsored you don't want to put that boat on the fine line because that's guess what you're like man I just spent that kind of money okay guess what I'm gonna have to cut back no one wants to hear that word but right now where we're at, the classes we're racing, we're having fun, we can continue to go have fun. Well, I mean, one of the classes, I mean, it's competitive. I, I was, I have my free ride boat here, Commander Industries built uh, like boat. super jet boat. Yeah, thanks. Uh, I mean, I've got Surf Slam in two weeks, and I didn't want to blow it up. But you know what? When I was out there, the competition was just pushing, pushing, pushing the entire time. You never let off the throttle, and it was, uh, it was good. It was good motoring. I, I just don't know what else to say. It was just good, good racing. Well, it's good to see, I hate to say it, I'm the older generation, but the younger generation kind of coming in and you guys taking charge because I'm stoked about it. You know, I need a couple weekends off, but it's the idea I'm stoked that you guys are coming in and you know what, you guys are accepting us old guys too at the same time. And, you know, for me, that's a big kick in the pants. So for me to be living in this sport this long, I'm pretty stoked because right now I'm pretty sure it's going to really start to flourish. Well, we wouldn't, we wouldn't be here if it wasn't for you guys paving the way and still keeping what you guys cherish so much going and it sets a great example for what um, what we need to get towards and accomplish and keep going um, to come to these events I mean it just gets me a better idea of you know what to expect down the road and what to keep alive and the the, the good heart like the aspects of uh, why we're here and why we're racing and it's good everything about it's super positive so nice. I'd love to hear that. Yeah. Hey, well, you got a chance. Let's hear. Let's thank your sponsors. Uh, I want to definitely thank uh, Bomber Eyewear, Liquid Militia, um, All American Videos uh, for putting this entire thing together. Um, <laughs> Commander Industry, Steve Webster builds incredible boats, some of the fastest here. Um, definitely want to thank Hydro Turf for making the boat look great. Performance Fiberglass wouldn't have my boat all together if it wasn't for them. Um, Patty's Cakes and Desserts, my family uh, bakery and business. Oh, nice. oh yeah. Oh, sweets. And all sweets and uh, Dave Stewart at Impros couldn't have uh, oh, definitely couldn't have gone as fast without him and that mag pump in my boat right now. Um, big shout out to John Dady at Blosion helping me out with uh, some of the small knickknack parts. Carl, Carl Granberg at Cold Fusion, uh, Kevin Collins at Leg Drag Watercraft, and um, I'm probably forgetting somebody, but you know what? Uh, KM David at uh, KMG Racing uh, right. didn't wouldn't have had the blaster here, uh, the KMG Racing blaster if it wasn't for them. Uh, Mystic Lubricants, again, Bomber Eyewear. Uh, all these all these people just coming out of the woodwork to help me out, and I, I can't appreciate it more. So. Well, hey, Mark Gomez, you heard it. He only needs more sponsors. <laughs> That's it. But, hey, dude, congratulations. I'm hey. so happy to see you up here. Hey, For me, it's pretty cool. These people have welcomed us into their arms. And, like I said, I'm trying to get the, the SoCal guys up here, and they really don't know what they're missing, really. Honestly, they, they don't. Know. They, they got to, I mean, it, it cost me, I think, in fuel with Tanner, uh, I think it cost us probably about 200 bucks in fuel. I'm I mean, way, yeah. make make the trip. I mean, set the weekend. It's well worth your money. You can't go wrong. Uh, and the